I feel like what's scaring me about this is that she's holding, but at any moment, she could decide to let go. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Lily and coming with another video. So in this video, I'm going to be doing a <laughs> roller set marathon. Y'all, I have been roller setting my hair every week for the past six weeks, maybe. I don't know, but we've been using a different product every week. Without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get into this video. This is the Design Essentials roller set and we use the avocado almond and avocado and i feel like this one is for natural hair like curly hair and um they have another one right and against my better judgment i picked this one instead of that one let me just show y'all what we got in here okay let me show y'all all right so i'm gonna start taking things down and i just want to see how things are looking. for about an hour okay an hour we had the bonnet on right before we when i got sleepy we cut the bonnet off and put on this here so we're gonna take this down Weightless, movement, body, 
you know i did add a little oil to it just to give it something you know but i won't be adding the oil you know throughout the week but just to help a little bit it's just perfection all right you guys so we have been under the hair dryer for like three hours maybe um i'm gonna just take these down Ooh. amazing we only put a little bit of oil just up the, at the top to just get the flyaways let me show you how that i cannot believe i wasn't recording it looks so pretty we're not gonna play with it too much because one at a time but i like this style it looks really really good okay see you in the next clip stretching our hair I feel like this did a good job stretching our hair we were able to comb it out without a problem like I honestly feel like my hair is dry and it feels so soft it really does it feels so soft it feels but I just feel like as far as holding a little bit more of the curl, she's not holding on to that curl, but she is giving us a little body. Look at like at the ends, we got a little flip going on. If you hear jingles, that's my dog. So, hold on. Motions is trash. Holding nothing look at my hair y'all it's reverting to like a natural curl y'all oh. 
you know what this reminds me of i knew it was too good to be true it reminds me of Kara care oh i'm so angry <sighs> let me let me have some more of my my keto child stuff hold on i'm on keto hold on motions is no okay i didn't sweat my hair out i did run to the store during my um my lunch to walgreens because i needed something and y'all look at my hair look at my hair so this is motions i sweat my hair out one because it's hot back here two the laminated machine is not working and three motions wasn't holding me down so I need to find something to pull my hair up with, but I just want to give you an update on that, okay? All right. Good morning, you guys. We're getting ready to go to work. Basically done, just making sure our lashes are together. But anyway, so motions. Motions for the purpose of a roller set by itself and then wearing it for a week by itself, hold no, okay? No. No. However, if you're going to put a flat iron on it, put some heat, then yes. I do like the way my hair feels. Um, it's just that it's a different formula for a different purpose. Um, so yeah, I just want to show y'all what my hair looks like. Because I needed to do something for the week. I really feel like wearing my hair curly and wearing it in a roller set or even if it is flat iron curls but i prefer like if it's curly like this for it not to be uh flat iron curls I, because i'm trying to reduce the heat that's the only reason um just trying to reduce the heat and even when i did the flat iron curls i tried to go in larger sections right we still had to put heat on it okay now, I don't want to just, you know, we put heat on it because my hair needs, it needs that. It needs that. But especially if I need to hold a curl. And so this is what we have. And I'm going to use these sponge rollers to roll it up every night. And that'll be that. Um, so, yeah. Good morning, you guys. It's, I don't know what day it is, y'all. Let me just tell you. Okay. So, I am doing the do gangster wrap um and i wanted to show this to y'all what i'm noticing with the do and the design essentials but more so with the do and this is something that i really like i can just wrap the hair and it's sticking to the roller um all of the roller sets are not like a hundred percent i'm not gonna lie they're not a hundred percent i'm doing the best i can but we have gotten better and i definitely see um hair growth like my hair is like i definitely see hair growth uh because it's you know low manipulation and you know everything like that is you know you do it the regular way i take a brush a soft bristle brush like this it helps to not put too much on there but what i'm noticing y'all is making like the root of my hair like super i don't want to say stretched but it's doing something to the root of my hair my hair is curly but when i put it on there it's like it stretches my hair to an extent um it stretches my hair and it's like sticking it's sticking to the roller. And then also, y'all, this smells 
amazing. Now this one smells like sugar and honey. You see how sh the hair at the root is like really like I mean because I don't think that I'm rolling them I'm rolling them tight but like not too tight a little goes a long way it really does I'm going to comb it. Oh, it combs very well. I'm scared. <laughs> it combs very well. It combs just as good as motions did. But like I said, this is just a preliminary. It combs very well. Y'all, this is scaring me because motions did the same thing, y'all. We see where that got us. But this is, ooh, it is fantastic. Look at in there. This is, <laughs> woo! <laughs> Sorry. I'm just gonna comb it out. This is how they did their hair back in the day day. I'm convinced I have cracked the cold. See, times like this, like you really gone. Maybe I should just do clip ins if I feel like I need more. But times like this make me so happy. Cause look at look at Let's just go outside. Okay, we're gonna go outside. We're gonna stop playing in our hair. We're gonna go outside and see. Let me find a headband and see what it is giving. Y'all, I am unsure whether or not I was recording or not. Um, seriously. So far, I really like this product. So we're gonna go ahead and take our hair down. Um, I have like three layers of, well, it's three, because I have like all my bonnets on. See? <laughs> anyway, let's take this down. I think I think definitely clip-ins y'all I think definitely clip-ins that I could just clip in like if I want volume and because my hair does shrink when I wear it like this but Hold on. Oh. <gasps> Do I have, okay. 
All right, so I'm gonna be honest. I have not put no oil in my hair y'all it is not weighed down or nothing and it looks like all my hopes and wishes you know it could stand a little bit of oil it could what is this i got something in my hair ow so we can get the okay <sighs> alright you guys <sighs> I took my dog out for a walk it is humid outside y'all it is humid it's not raining about the rain, but it's that Houston, Texas humidity. Um, well, okay. Um, I was so excited to give this the top spot, but she can't get the top spot. She just, she can't get the top spot. And I'm glad I, uh, oh, y'all. All right, you guys. So we're going to go ahead and get into the ranking. But before I do that, I want to offer a quick, quick disclaimer these opinions that I'm about to express are all my own. I am not sponsored or paid or any of that. I bought all of these products with my own money. I wanted to share my experiences because oftentimes being a natural or straight natural, whatever the case may be, it's hard to do so when things do not come out the way you want them to come out. Um, especially like we're working, we have jobs, we have things to do. We don't have all day to be trying to figure out what is the perfect combination of products and techniques to get our hair together, okay? And so I have been taking the time to do the research. Um, I've been improving my technique. I've been sitting under the hair dryer for like two days sometimes it can be. So it, it, all of that is time that I could be spending elsewhere. And so y'all, if I didn't get this video together i was gonna just start wearing wigs <laughs> i am trying to stick it out and really wear my own hair but it has been a struggle so without further ado i'm gonna give you my honest opinion i am sorry if some of the brands might not like what i have to say but at the end of the day either your product works or it don't very simple okay let's move on so how do we define if a product is going to work or it's not working okay so i have on the on the chart we have holding humidity proof and drying time okay these are what is what what i would look at uh factors for success okay so how long do i have to sit under the hair dryer okay very important because i didn't got all day number two okay uh are you holding the curl and then when you hold the curl are you humidity proof i have to go outside i have things to do i have to be out and about i am not trying to leave the house looking fly and then go to work or go to the grocery store and i get in my car and everything then broke loose okay so we, we these are this these are non-negotiables okay you have to perform if you don't perform you don't work we have to move on so just want to let you know that is what I'm looking for. If I can get a product that will hold my hair and it will be almost the equivalent of a flat iron curl, okay, that is optimal, all right? That is a perfect world. I'm not really expecting all of that, but if we get it, amen. The next thing I wanna go over is the grading scale. We're taking that from when I was a teacher, 
okay so when i was a teacher obviously a 100 or a 10 that's gonna be an a okay you got an a you did what you're supposed to do you 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 understood the assignment okay now a 70 that's passing okay <laughs> you, you you average okay you doing you you just getting by those are my favorite now really a f is 69 but i like to give a 65 okay some f's are better than others okay and if you're a teacher you understand the phrase a f is a f that mean don't give them too low okay because you they, they will never recover from a 13 okay so that's why sometimes the grade book will be full of zeros but he got that 65 all right it just depends it just depends so i'm gonna start at the bottom motions baby girl <laughs> she getting a 45 okay like if you gave a child a 45 they they deserve that and they gonna get that 45 let me tell you because motions had me at work looking crazy okay she had me looking crazy she all right on the positive gonna start the positive okay positive i love the way my hair felt okay when i took it down this was a great this is a great product for um flat ironing okay if you want to flat iron your hair this is a great product um as far as holding the curl i don't know she didn't do she she didn't do what she was supposed to be doing but okay she did do fast drying she dried really fast you know okay and it's great for stretching and my hair was not crunchy however she did not pass the humidity test and holding yeah baby girl she really deserved a zero okay but we gave her a 50 all right so be grateful for that moving on to design essential she really should be lower but I don't know why I thought I liked her more than I did. And that, th that was because I actually flat iron curled my hair. That's what happened. Okay, because baby girl did not dry. So I couldn't test humidity. Yeah, she she gonna have to get that 50. We might have to retest her, but baby girl gonna get that 50. Because I, I thought I liked my hair that week, but nah, it wasn't that week. It was another week, and I'll talk about it later. Yeah, moving on, Kara Care. Baby girl... <laughs> <laughs> has not done anything we needed her to do okay she didn't hold nothing she didn't do no humidity you know the drying time you know it felt light though on a positive note i liked the way my hair felt it felt like there was nothing on my hair because technically it probably wasn't nothing on my hair she moisturized very well but look she didn't hold she didn't do what she was supposed to be doing she did not accomplish the task at hand but i still like her <laughs> I still like her. A little favoritism right there. I'm going to give her the 55. All right. Camille Rose. Camille Rose. Spiked honey mousse. All right. Listen, she passed the humidity test. I looked at the footage. She passed the humidity test. Okay. Even on my hair, on my left side, I have a looser hair. And I don't know what it is. That's something that I noticed that that side of my hair, it doesn't always hold a curl anyway. Just, I just noticed that. But she was holding something, um, and she just probably wasn't dry, and we might need to give her a retest. We might need to do small group instruction with Camille um, Rose. We might see. Um, the drying time, we're going to give her a 50. Humidity, she can get a 70. And then whole, you know, we're going to give her the 50. But because we need, to, I feel like we need to do some more testing, because I did kind of like the way she was looking. I'm also going to take note that I didn't do the same technique that I did on the second round as far as the soft rollers so i don't know i just kind of feel like you know further testing is necessary with the camille rose but i don't know if i want to risk it right now but i'm gonna give her a 65 so the do gangster wrap my hair felt amazing and it dried very very well i don't know what the do has like as a brand what they have in their um products but i like the way my hair responds to their products and how it, it just snatches the rollers right on up i really like that however it it didn't hold the curl okay from the from the roller set however when i did the soft rollers it held okay and then it also looked like it would have looked if i would have flat on my hair okay but the problem was the curls were falling too quickly okay within literally a couple of hours okay my hair I like this product, but we it, it needs something else, okay? Because it, it wasn't holding. You can't use this by itself. Drying time, we're going to give it a 10. Humidity, she gets a zero, okay? Because she did not do what she was supposed to be doing. And I even shortened up the video because I didn't want to say what I w was going to say. But, yeah, I had choice words. Hold, I don't know. She need a 50. 
she gonna get that 50 and then she gonna go ahead and get this 65 because i love the brand okay that's why we're gonna give her the 65 but i don't know for something that just came out and it, it just kind of underwhelmed me i don't know okay nairobi and lot of body i'm gonna talk about them together because listen we did that in the last video they did a great job but at the same time they were not dry so we cannot test a humidity if the cur if the hair is not already dry okay however even with the hair not being entirely dry they were still trying to hold something okay and i have used them in the past you do have to sit under the hair dryer i have to sit under the hair dryer for a very very long time probably 12 hours and that's on a light day okay <laughs> so yeah and we didn't use soft rollers in these last tests okay so i'm still gonna put them but that when you when they finally dry it's crunchy y'all it's crunchy and it's dry and a lot of body would give me flakes so we're gonna put them down there they're gonna get that 80 they're gonna get that 80 moving on okay we're gonna go to the do moose stuff i like them however they didn't technically pass that humidity test i looked at it i don't know I, don't, I didn't like the way my hair was looking but i liked the way it held it held very very well okay and we did heatless curls we did not do the soft rollers like we were it did in the second round so you know i think moose Duff is really good okay they they dry well i, I just like the whole brand except the other one i i love them all, all together moving on to the do honey best roller set that we did okay and i'm gonna I'm I'm insert some footage okay this was the best roller set we did with no heat we did flat on our roots but when i tell you it's ever so gentle on that because i didn't have to do too much it worked perfectly she getting a straight up 100 okay passing the class with honors because she did what she was supposed to do all right guys so this was a great learning opportunity for myself i'm not gonna lie i am all roller set it out um i have been thinking about getting a v-part wig because the amount of time that it takes but y'all it is so worth it i just feel like my natural hair has never looked better and i am so 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 happy i'm not gonna lie i've been thinking about getting some clip-ins just to you know because when my hair curls we lose a little bit of the length but it's worth it because my hair is holding a curl and it looks good and it's not a shirley temple curl so i'm thankful that i've been doing this project this project this process because i'm learning more about my hair and i'm finding like what works best for me and my hair is growing because we're not putting direct heat on it and i'm super proud um like my little bangs have grown out you know and it's fine because we just put that there but i'm definitely thinking about just getting some clip-ins i'm super tired i hope you enjoyed this video go ahead like comment and subscribe and i will see you in the next one